Hi guys, welcome to Empty Game, and this is Creedzy right here, and I'm going to be bringing you a video on how to fix your Batman Arkham Asylum game for PC. Some people have been having a lot of stuttering issues and slowdown issues and general crashing issues because they totally effed the game up. Yes, they did, but not that badly if you know how to fix it, which I'm going to show you how to do today. It is extremely hot in this country right now, which I'm in London right now, and it's about 23 degrees, which doesn't seem like much, but in London, that is like the Sahara Desert. Okay? So I'm hot. My fan is a tower fan, he ain't doing crap. So, without further ado, here's how you fix the game. So you're going to want to go to Steam, open up your Steam, and find your Batman Arkham Asylum game. Then you're going to want to right click it and go to properties. Once you're in properties, you want to go to local files. From local files, you will then go to uh, browse local files. From browse local files, you will then go to BMG game or BM game. And then you want to go to config. From config, you're going to want to click BM system settings and open up that file. You are now looking in this giant mass of totally unnecessary uh, words for max frames per second you are going to want to change this as you can see right here here is my max frames per second no matter what you do change it to 120 frames per second is probably your best choice changing it to 60 will cap you at 60 which is not a very good idea because if you can go higher than 60 then you should and then cap yourself at 60 frames per second well now that i've done that you're going to want to click it and save it i've already done that so let's exit out x it out Boom. Annex this out. Boom. Close this. Boom. So at this moment, you are pretty much done with the Steam side of the game. Your game is now set to run at a nice 60 frames per second at least. You are no longer capped. So now you want to move on to right clicking your screen and clicking personalization. If you are on Windows 8, then it might be slightly different, but all you have to do is find your personalized settings. From personalized settings, you are going to want to click window color. From window color, you're going to want to turn off all of your transparency. You're going to want to turn off everything that is into this box. So you are basically turning off windows arrow. That is the most important thing in this video because windows arrow seems to conflict with the graphical settings of Batman Arkham Asylum. It has a large issue when you go to play it. I figured this out because I am a tech geek and I play about my computer on a regular basis, even while I'm gaming. Anywho, moving on. For some reason I spoke a lot longer in this video. I'll probably cut this in at the end because I am re-recording and X this out. Next, we are going to want to go to Steam. And we're going to want to find Batman Arkham, Batman Arkham Asylum. I'm going to show you that this game actually freaking works. So we're going to click the game, play the game. We're going to click play, play, play the game. Yes, yes, we're going to play the game. So we're going to show you that 60 frames a second is working and that you are getting a steady game. No freezing, no stuttering, no crashes, no crunches, nothing. And I'm going to let the game load. Hello guys and welcome back to my video on this game. Here we go with Batman Arkham Asylum. I forgot to turn on, let me turn down the game. Oh my God, I was playing this recently and it's turned up too loud. Okie dokie. Here we go guys. This is the game and let me do something really quick. I'm going to show you that this is running at 60 frames a second. I have done this the wrong way round. Bear with me, please. As you can see, I am hot. I have done this wrong, as, like, for the first time ever. Um, I need to turn on Afterburner. That's the one. MSI Afterburner. So you guys can see exactly what I'm getting out of this game. I'm going to turn GOG off as well because that is totally uncalled And I have a motorbike going right through my video. It's so good. I'm not updating MSI, you can kiss my butt to that. Um, and here we go. As you can see now, you see my frames per second on the screen. What does it say? It says 60 frames a second. Like that, take that, console bitches. And I press play on my pad. I go to my 65% almost finished game. 
It loads. It looks pretty. It's Batman. Woohoo. I do not start a new one. I go to uh, options. From options, I take you to my graphical settings. I go from graphical settings to show you that everything is on high. Everything is on high and on. As you can see, nothing is low settings. I come out of this. I go into the game. Which I don't want to be playing right now because it's hot. Okay, I go into the game. Keep an eye on the MSI pink printout at the top of the screen. You will see what my frames per second are. As long as it's above 30, then this has worked. As long as the game doesn't crash and it doesn't go crazy and start going all slow and stuff, then I have worked my magic. We are at 40 frames a second at this moment. Just thereabouts. And as we jump into the game, you guys should see that it is more than 30 frames a second. I am running two SLI. I'm running uh, GTX 970s and SLI. The Gigabyte Gaming 1 SLI GTX 970 goodness stuff. And this game's taking longer than usual to load. I'm really sorry for this. And here we go. Getting four frames a second. 5960 there we go guys boom okay I'm gonna jump off of here just to show you oh look at 60 frames a second guys Woo look who fixed your game for you a comment in the section below just to show that I'm a damn and you couldn't figure it out but I did oh I just got run over ain't that just some bull crap what are you gonna do what are you gonna do what are you gonna do huh look I'm standing up here what are you gonna do what are you gonna do you can stand around like a fool how you like me? How you like me? You can't do nothing when I'm standing up here. Oh! Boom! Let's give you some of the... Oh! Who told you to run me? Over, bitch! Huh? Over, bitch! Bitch! Over! So as you can see... Oh! Get the, take that in the... Batman in your face! In your face! So as you can see, I'm not too happy with what they've done. Oh! Oh no, he took me down. Batman's not happy now, dude. Boom! And as you can see, the game is running so much nicer, it's pretty, it's beautiful, it's what it's supposed to be. The graphics are good, the game is good, Batman's looking hot as hell because he's a badass. I got my car going all over the place and everything's good, as you can see, everything is good. It's good, it's the PC version. Thank you for watching my video, hope that helped you to fix your game. This is Creedzy, I've drank too much Red Bull, good night. Yeah.